spent the day milling a log to continue the coop project and I got uh, the five two by twos I need to do the rafters which is it for two by two so I got enough scrap to finish off the little odds and ends that I need to do and then I got uh, one two one two three four six I got seven uh, decent boards three quarter thick and a couple junky ones uh, that can you know make up whatever extras I need. Now this is definitely not enough to do all the siding on this coop. It four boards will do uh, the the front side. In fact, four boards won't even do the front side because it's six feet long and these boards are only five and some feet long. So. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with that, but obviously uh, you'll get to see it <clears throat> as I go or when it's done. So anyway, that's what I did today. It's uh, quite a process, you know, mill the log, you know, got to set everything up and then bust out the table saw and, and make square lumber. So anyway, that's where I'm at. All right, so here we are. Another day. It's like, I don't know, day 10 or something ridiculous. Uh, the reality of creating the lumber that you need as you go to build something means that everything takes a ridiculous amount of time. Um, so, yesterday I milled up some lumber and today the goal is to get the rafters cut, uh, the bird's mouth for the rafters cut, and then probably start putting the face of the coop together. Uh, I had in my head that I was going to take the boards that I milled and and lay them out horizontally on the coop. Now I think it's probably going to look better if I go vertically. Plus it'll work better for me for the lengths of lumber that I have. Um, obviously going to have to mill more lumber before this project is through, but uh, as it is uh, that's just how it goes. So I've laid out, you can't see it, but I've laid out a template for my rafters here. I'm going to cut this one, this junk piece, I'm going to cut it. If it fits, then I'm going to use it as a template for all my good ones. So I guess uh, let's get her done. This is my setup for cutting the rafters. Made a template. Use the circ saw and then a hand saw to finish it. Trying to be careful not to uh, overcut because they're so thin.
base on here. Um, you now just doing the side, and all I'm doing is clamping the board up, scribing the line on the back side, cutting it off with the circular saw. Yeah, so that's how that goes. Do that a bunch more times and probably have two sides on. Alright, going to move forward on this project here today. I took the day off yesterday, just wasn't feeling it. Uh, but we're going to work on the door and get this done. I noticed a couple of things uh, just looking at this coop yesterday was that some of my boards have shrunk a little bit. And so there's a <clears throat> bit of a gap developing in them. I might do a batten. We'll see. Also notice that uh, one of my boards uh, this on the side there has started cupping. <clears throat> so I might have to fire some screws in there. I didn't really want to. I stapled most of it in there. But, uh, you know, if the boards are just going to pull themselves off, I guess I'm going to have to screw them in. So I've got the outline of my door ready to go. Put a cross piece in and then put some siding on it and hang it or at least uh, the edge siding so that I can get the hinge set up right. Anyway, let's just get her done, get this over with, I'm tired of this. move on here all right I'm definitely going overboard now definitely
for a chicken coop. I know. All right, one more side of the batten and then we can actually move on to doing the more complicated part, which is the nesting boxes. So I'm not looking forward to it. All right, I milled up some more boards and uh, so we're just gonna keep firing them up. And I put screws in here just cause there's gonna be a roof on there. So maybe the wind might grab it, whatever. probably where this is going to end at least for today for me and uh, I'll finish this off probably tomorrow and uh, you know get as much on film as I can for you guys anyway thanks again for watching have a good one